Married at First Sight UK star spared jail over altercation and says he's holding himself accountable. The star was accused of harassing and using threatening language towards a woman. Married at First Sight's Thomas Hartley has avoided jail after pleading guilty to a public order offence after an altercation in London. Star was accused of harassing and using threatening language towards a woman. He was seen marrying Adrian Sanderson on last year. A source said, Thomas was caught up in a row in London and was nicked last February. He put his hands up and pleaded guilty when he was in court last month. Thomas wants to move on from the incident as it is not something he is proud of. He was arrested and pleaded guilty in Liverpool Nosley and St. Helens Magistrates Court on September A representative for Thomas told The Sun, in February this year Thomas was struggling with addiction to alcohol and drugs following his departure from Married at First Sight and the impacts that had on his mental health. This resulted in a mental breakdown and drug-induced mental health episode that spilled out publicly at Euston Station. His rep went on, nevertheless Thomas accepts that witnessing a mental health crisis can be upsetting and further made difficult when you are a fan of the person suffering the episode. He accepts that swearing at the woman to leave him alone during the drug-induced mental health crisis was no doubt deeply upsetting for her. He has held himself accountable for that in pleading guilty and has taken steps to prevent that happening again. They continued, currently, Thomas is battling withdrawals from antidepressants, along with suffering with bipolar disorder and anxiety. He is currently under supervision to prevent suicide as a result of the steps he is taking to ensure he can live a safe and happy life. Due to the severity of withdrawal he is also attending therapy for his mental health. Today's next update. Broken bride heartbreaking moment married at first sight bride Peggy breaks down in tears married at first sight bride Peggy breaks down in tears tonight when she confronts George in front of the group. Says her husband needs constant guidance and reassurance in their relationship and the pressure is taking its toll. During an emotional commitment ceremony that will air Wednesday evening, she tells experts Paul and Charlene about George's behavior, it has had a negative impact. I've come into this process wanting someone to support me for once and I feel like I'm always trying to reassure George that he's a good person and advise him on his actions that they can be perceived negatively. Turning to her husband, Peggy adds, I feel like I'm talking to you but you're not digesting it. But I need you to listen and realize what I'm saying to you. Peggy continues to sob as George whispers, I'm sorry, and fellow bride Ella Morgan comments, Oh my God, she seems broken. Sports physio George and Peggy a technology risk partner from Kent are three weeks into the marriage experiment. But while the pair had a strong attraction to one another from the off, it has been far from plain sailing for the newlyweds on the series. The French hunk said he wanted to walk away from filming when he and Peggy butted heads during the show. He told The Sun, I thought I can't do this she's way too difficult and doesn't want to listen, she doesn't understand me or nothing is good enough. Georges said, I was bending over backwards. If you give me feedback I'll work on it and let me know where I'm going wrong I'll fix it. But at times I'd be sat there thinking is this for me? I literally couldn't do anything right. She's great to look at but she's after a different caliber of man. She's very old school and I'm very much new school and old school. At times I was like this girl is born in the wrong era. I was definitely kept on my toes. Despite their ups and downs though, George said Peggy was just what he'd asked the experts for. Today's next update. Green Fingers married at first sight's Roz shows off her parents' huge garden as the show ROZZ from Married at First Sight has shared a clip of herself running around her parents' huge garden to share her real self with fans. Florist was paired with Thomas in the experiment, but things were frosty between the couple. 
Rosalind admitted early on in the show that she was not attracted to her husband, which put a strain on their relationship. The cracks began to show even more clearly after they consummated their marriage and Roz shared that she still had not developed feelings for him. Now the crew local is back in the real world, she is keen to show viewers there is more to her than the quiet woman who appeared on the program. In the clip she posted to Instagram, Roz can be seen running through fields chasing after potential customers with outstretched arms. She wrote, So, I'm a little crazy really, the show may be showing a different side to me right now, but the truth is I am a bit nutty. I love chatting and I adore company. The florist went on to talk about her two jobs, adding, I run my own business, I've run my floristry business now for a good couple of years, I've always had a love for flowers, I've never imagined myself anywhere else but working outdoors and I in lockdown I set up flower growing, I was very lucky to have some space on my parents' farm, so I started learning all things growing in 2019 and now here we are. Most of my orders through the summer months all come from the paddock. I truly love my job and I am forever grateful for all the opportunities which have come my way. The only thing about being a flower farmer is, it can be lonely, so whenever a customer comes to the paddock I just never want them to. Thanks for watching this videos, please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.